Hi. The integration of e-commerce with social media is becoming ever more important. So today I'm going to talk about the Konecart Messenger bot. As you can see, there's a young lady bot. She works 24 by 7 and she'll help you find products managed by a Konecart store using the Facebook Messenger interface. The bot goes beyond simple keyword searches and uses the Wit AI artificial intelligence engine to attempt to understand certain message types, and these are called intents, and then to respond accordingly. More technically, it's a piece of software sitting on top of Kona Cart that receives messages from Messenger and uses the Wit AI artificial intelligence engine to attempt to understand them. Wit AI allows you to build a Siri-like speech or message interface by turning natural language into actionable data. So based on the interpretation by the artificial intelligence engine, the bot servlet communicates with the Konecart engine to find products and sends the results back to the messenger user as a reply message. Now the full source code is available and it's architected in order to allow you to add functionality in order to process more message types. It can be considered as a framework allowing you to create your own bot with bespoke functionality. Konecart Professional Services can also help you with this. The idea is that you create an AI app and you train it to recognize certain message types. In this demo app, we've trained it for four types of intents. So to begin with, somebody may not have a clue about what your store actually sells and so may ask questions like, what's available? What products are available? Or what products you sell? What's your range of products? Or just what do you sell? And when we recognize this intent, we reply with the names of the top level categories that the customer can click on to eventually get to the, some products. So let me show you how that works by asking the bot a question. So I asked the bot, what do you sell? You see, it's replied with the categories of products that are sold by the store, computer peripherals, games, DVD movies, software, electronics, home and garden, gifts, I quite fancy to buy a lawnmower today, so let me click on Home and Garden. It detects that underneath Home and Garden there are three subcategories. Let me click on Lawnmowers. So here you see it's actually returned the lawnmowers that are sold by the store. For each lawnmower, I get an image, I get a link to open the, the actual product detail page on the store itself. I've got a Buy button, I see the price. Let me just flick through these. Okay, I've quite seen one I quite fancy, an ecological model. It doesn't seem very complicated. It's cheap, so let me go and buy that. So it's been added to the cart. Now I can just check out. Here I seamlessly go to the Kona Cart storefront. I can sign in with Facebook. And I get to the checkout page, the checkout confirmation page. Here I see my product has been added. That's the final price. Let me confirm the order. And great, my order's gone through. It will be with me within two to five working days. That's fantastic. We've, we've added four different intents. So now let me uh, go to the second type of question that I can ask, which is, it's been trained to recognize keywords or just phrases. So you can say, you know, I'm looking for clocks or do you sell lawnmowers? Find me an iPad. Now, uh, I'm really looking for a bin for my kitchen, so let me type in, you know, I'm, uh, I'm looking for a bin. I'm looking for a bin. Okay, it looks like it only sells one bin, so let me look at that. Uh, I quite fancy that one, so let me go ahead and buy it, and it's on sale as well, so... You see, in this case, it recognizes that the product, I need to kind of select options before I can go ahead and buy the product. So in this case, I need to select the color. So I pick a red one. Now that's been added to the cart, I can check out. Good. So in this case, if I go and see what's in the cart, I see that there's the, the red bin that's been added to the cart, and as before, I can just check out and buy it. Now, everyone likes a bargain, as well as searching for products, so we've also trained the bot to recognize questions like, show me clocks on sale, uh, reduce clocks, special offer clocks, what's on offer? Now, I'll show you how that works, so let me type in 
Uh, clock's on sale. And here you see it's just shown me a couple of clocks and both have been reduced. This one's been reduced from $133.99 to $120. This one's been reduced from $94.99 to $75.99. So it's shown me the clocks that are on sale. And that's different to what I get if I choose uh, just clocks. So if I just type in clocks, here it shows me all of the clocks, or the clocks by certain manufacturers, Actim, Newgate, Eddington's, West Clocks. So let me choose all clocks. And it will just show me a list of the clocks that are available. And you see that the first one, it's been ordered, um, I think in this case, by popularity, but you can, you can program it to order it whichever way you want. Now, another intent that we've actually programmed in is to be able to find the latest products that have been added to a catalog. So I could ask things like the latest clocks or what's new or show me the most recent clocks, the new clocks. Uh, so let me type that in. And if I type in new clocks, What you'll see is that the Cadiz clock is no longer the late, the first one that's shown, but it's the West clocks, the first one that's shown, because this is the, the most recent one that was added to the catalog. As I said, the ordering of the products can be however you, you want to display them to your customers, and you can add a new intent so people can find, show me the cheapest clocks, show me the most expensive clocks, and so on and so on. Now, being a bot, you can also program in questions that aren't related to products. For example, in an e-commerce store, somebody may ask you, uh, I want to see my orders. So you can type in something like uh, my orders and program the bot to understand that. So in this case, it does understand it. It's the, the order's intent. And uh, it says, please go to konecar.com and log in. And there you can see your orders. So we go there. We get in and you can see the, the last orders. So the last product I bought was the Bosch uh, lawnmower. Okay, so that's about it for the demo. If you'd like any more details, please contact us at konacart.com and we'll see if we can help you to get your own personalized bot up and running in no time. Thank you very much for your time. Bye-bye.